Hello guys, good afternoon. This is our new Flagstaff camper, 2024. Um, I closed the blinds because Lucy is barking at the neighbors or the other camp neighbor's dog. So I had to close it. But anyway, this is standing at the doorway. And when you walk in, this is our panel. This controls all of our heat, our lights, the water pump, um, anything like that. The bedroom lights, our um, Bluetooth connection. And then this is our thermostat. It has heat and air. Um, it's all electric, but the water you can do either gas or electric. So, um, the only, actually there's two things that are, um, gas. You can do the water heater or the stove, but this is, as you walk in the front door, there's her bed by our little table. And like I said, the blinds are closed over there because the neighbors are over there. And then this is our kitchen. So we've got a little bit of counter space. It's enough, you know. I wasn't sure if it was going to be enough room, but I really like how much space I have. I don't really have any complaints about not having enough room. We have a freezer and a fridge, and they're both pretty good size. And it does open from either side. So you can open it from this side, or you can open it from this side. And it's that way on both of them, the fridge and the freezer. So you come over this way. We have a microwave up there. We have storage all the way around here. Um, in the ceiling, our AC vents are in the ceiling. And then that is a, like a little window that you can open to let air in. Um, this is air conditioning unit that's on the ceiling. But if you come down, we've got a light and a fan over the stove. Here's our gas stove. Sorry about the pan. I need to do dishes. But there's a stove. Um, it's got a decent sized oven. I mean, we couldn't cook a turkey in it or anything. I mean, we cut a small one, but anyway, that's the, um, stove and then our sink and the dishes are in there underneath the sink. It's all one big sink. And then it's got that little, um, like workstation, I guess you could set a plate on there or a cutting board and still use that as counter area. Um, this does have a regular flow and then a jet. So depending on, you know, what you might need, um, we do have a little bit of space there. We're going to hang this up on the wall. Um, and then underneath the sink down here is where we have our storage and there's an electrical panel and he's got tools and stuff down there, but there's a little bit of storage down there. And then if you come over here, we've got three cabinets right here and they're all three the same. They have, um, two shelves there which I need to take that towel and go get it washed. And they all three have a little drawer like this that you can pull out that you can put stuff in. So they do have locks on them down here so that when you travel, they won't pop open and they shut pretty quiet. They're not very loud. And if you come over here, here's our little dining room table with the, um, two benches. That table does collapse down. That's the TV there that we put outside. We got a TV mount outside, so that's what that is. But this table does go down, so that this turns into a bed. So it's probably, I would say, maybe a little bit shorter than a full-size bed. I mean, somebody tall would not be able to sleep on it. But um, it could sleep, too, because it's about a full-size or a super-sized twin, I would say. There's storage down below each bench down here. And these drawers are pretty... I mean, there's a lot of room in them, so, um, and then we do have a light up here. They all, all of the curtains have shades and blinds. So, like I said, I pulled those. You come over this way from the table, and this is right as you walk in the front door. It's right behind me over here. But here is our little two recliners, and the footrests do come up. There are cup holders in both of them. There's a charging station for your phone. Um, and then inside here is storage, like for remotes or cords or whatever you want to put in there to store. We've got three storage compartments up here, which um, I don't think we have anything. No, we don't have anything in them. We're not going to bring a lot of stuff up here because we don't want it to be super crowded. These lights here, they put off 
pretty good light. There's also a USB charger. And there's one of those in every single one of these. So I have, there's one there. We have one here. And then there's also two more in our bedroom because the bedroom's over here. But if I turn around from where these little recliners are, there's the bedroom. We have this little, our TV and like pretty much our entertainment station. So we've got the TV. There's a sound bar, a little shelf. We put a clock there and then I'm getting ready to go do laundry. So don't mind that. And then there's our fireplace, which Lucy loves the fireplace. And um, all of our heat is on the floor. You can see the vents on the floor. But if you keep going from the recliners over this way, you come into the bedroom, which the bed was made and the bed did look good. And Lucy decided to mess it up in all the pillows. So here's our bed and pillows. It's a full size bed, I would say, because uh, I think that's what size. Um, Sheets and stuff I put on it. There's also three more of those storage compartments, like what's above the sofa there. And then there's those two lights. And this and where the sofa is are both our bump out. So when you travel, you bring this in and then where the recliners are, you bring them in. But there's a little shelf right there for you to charge or for you to put your phone or if you want to drink or you have a book you're reading, you can set it there. And then we also have down here on the side of the bed, there's two outlets there. So you can plug something in there. Um, this bed does lift up and there's storage underneath that. I'm not going to do that right now. But we also have two drawers down underneath here. And that's where I store the broom because I don't have a lot of places where I can hang anything. But we've got two big drawers underneath there. And then over here on my side of the bed... There's my little shelf. I have my Bible and my books and some glasses. And then I have this little shelf here with my Bluetooth speaker on it. And then I also have um, a plug in here, but instead of mine being an outlet, it's a USB charging. So there's one there. And then, like I said, there's one on each one of these lights. And then you come around from the bed and there's another TV up here. And then this is our closet. And the closet is pretty good size um let me open so I can show you there is room for some storage in there um but we don't really have a lot in there just a few things I tucked away my craft stuff because I was getting ready to work on it we have our heat water pump is down there and then we have two big drawers here that we have clothes on like beach towels and stuff in and we have two doors on this camper so here is the other door it goes out towards the back. We brought a ladder because we're going to work on some stuff outside. And then here's our bathroom. And it's got a stand-up shower. Um, there's storage down here underneath the sink. There's also a plug-in there. Here's the um, faucet and the counter space. There's not a lot, but there's just enough. I mean, you're only camping. And then here is our medicine cabinet where... You have shelves and stuff in there and then you come over here and this is the only other storage we have is two of these um, and they run from the floor to the ceiling but they kind of go back to a wedge you see so there's not a lot of storage you can't fit a lot in there but we just put our towels there which I'm getting ready to go wash and then peroxide and alcohol and washcloths and like um, Febreze is down there and then up here is where he has his stuff on one shelf and I have mine on the other. Here's the door that walks out. It's kind of hard. This isn't very big in here. That door goes out to where the recliners and the TVs are. And then right around the corner here, opposite from the medicine cabinet, is our for our towel bar. I'm getting ready to mop. And then our toilet. And it's not a compostable toilet. This actually has, we have a sewer line going out that goes to the sewer. But there are lights here. One is for one on the ceiling. And then the other one, there's um, a night light down underneath. Let me see if I can, no, wrong one. Underneath the sink. So we turn that on at night as a night light. Um, and then this door here is a pocket door or a pole. It just slides open. And that's the other door so that closes and then we'll just go out this door so when you're 
done getting your shower getting ready then you just come out right here so it's kind of just one little circle um, we do have storage also we've got a fire extinguisher there I didn't mention that this is our pantry and it goes from the ceiling all the way down not quite to the floor there's storage down there for your shoes or whatever you might want to store down there um, and then inside here there are some shelves so there's four shelves um, that we've got stuff on and food and everything but anyway so both doors have a screen on them and then the outside door and you can just slide that over so you don't get bugs in we are looking and there's steps that go down on both of these we are looking at possibly getting um, an all glass door for the outside on one of these so that when Lucy's in here she can lay here and look out and she can see us so but anyway that's our little tour of our Flagstaff camper um, if you guys are thinking about getting one we've really been happy with ours we've only had it maybe two months um, but it's got a nice big window there that we can see out that window does not open but all the other windows open and we have two emergency exits one is over here by the table and the other one is the very back window at the back of the camper right back there so anyway um, you could see the bump out through the window there that's where the bed is so that's one bump out and then I'm standing on the other one so anyway I hope you guys like this video um, if you have any questions about it just drop them down below um, don't forget to give me a like and a share and the campground that we stay at they do a lot of concerts and have a lot of activities so I may end up posting some of that content on here too so anyway have a great summer hope you guys um, have a good one and have a blessed day thanks for watching